Hey, I just wanted to answer a couple of questions uh, after my last video on the Great Pyrenees. Of course, I said, and this is Groot. Groot, say hi. Yeah, this is Groot. He's a good dog. He's about a year and a half old, and as you can see, they really grow fast. So I'll stand up now so maybe he won't knock me over because he is a huge dog. But uh, I had a couple of inquiries on uh, a couple of things, and I wanted to touch on them real quick. And... Uh, this is one of those little extra videos that I put in that's maybe a little different, a little off topic of uh, encouragement. But I think dogs are good. Dogs are good for people, and I really do know why they're called man's best friend. Um, but one of the questions I had was on the, um, someone was talking to me about the fencing and uh, the um, invisible fence containment type thing. And um, I wanted to touch on that for a moment, which I had looked into it quite a bit when we was you know, when Groot was growing up and, uh, you know, going to be into a bigger dog and, you know, he'd want more room to run. And, um, but now the fencing that where you put it in your house and like you or you can put it in an area and it has a radius, you know, where it'll, uh, give them a little shock if you got the collar on and let them know not to go that, you know, anywhere past that. I don't really know if that would work with the Great Pyrenees. I'd read up on it because I wanted to give it a shot with mine, but, uh, some of them said that the hair, Great Pyrenees, as you could see by Groot, and if you look in this thumbnail, the thumbnail is a close-up of my dog Groot, and as you can tell, they've got a lot of hair, and they're, they're almost like a big polar bear out in your front yard, and, um, but that hair would not really give a good connection for the collar. And so, whereas a lot of dogs, if they're, you know, thin-coated, they might run and get near that, and they would feel a little bit of the bzzz, you know, and they'd know, okay, we're going to go back toward the house. You know, Great Pyrenees has all that protection. It's sort of like having a two or three coats on, and it wouldn't get the full effect of somebody that didn't have a coat on at all, because that's what they've got, a lot of hair. So, I wouldn't really suggest that, but, you know, anybody's free to try it. But I didn't go that route, and that was why, because of the hair. And then also... I was talking uh, with someone regarding the dog food, and, you know, uh, what I feed mine is the Diamond Natural, and uh, th this is really good dog food, and, you know, I, I tried her on some other kind, or him on some other kinds as a puppy growing up, but, uh, of course, some of the better dog foods, they was just so expensive, and uh, I actually seen someone that had two or three Pyrenees, and uh, they said they had switched to this, and then I got to reading the reviews, and it had so many good reviews that that's what I'm trying. So again, I'm not telling you to try it, but I am just saying that is what I feed mine. Diamond Natural, the chicken and rice, and he loves it. He's been on it now, I guess, about seven or eight months, and um, and you can get a 40-pound bag for like $35. So, you know, that's, that's pretty good compared to what one of the other kinds I was getting him to start with was around $15 for a six pound bag. So that right there tells you that, uh, you know, I was giving them, uh, you know, quite a little bit, uh, or giving quite a little bit more for it. But so that was the two things I wanted to cover was um, for my dogs, and that's the dog food, uh, Diamond Natural. And like I said, I'm not telling you to try it, but that is what I feed mine, and they seem to love it, or Groot does. And uh, I don't feed that to my other one. My other one eats some other, but Groot's a pure great Pyrenees. The other one's a Pyrenees mix. And then uh, also on the invisible fence, you're free to try it if you want. But I thought, well, you know, I think mine's just got a little bit too much hair that that wouldn't work for mine. So, you know, you really need to just study up and see. So that's it for this video. Thank you very much. And our next video will be the teaching video. So we'll catch you on the next video.